Folks, I did something odd, intriguing, a little magic, maybe a little magical, and uh, always, of course, absolutely ridiculous. Yesterday I made macaroni and cheese, and then I dumped in a bunch of uh, canned chili with it. It's actually really good, but wait till you see what I'm about to do on top of that. All right, folks, I just microwaved it. Mm-mm, good. But what I'm gonna do, I've also got chunks of ham in there that I put in there. I'm gonna put in some of these Frito flavor twists. Mmm. Just for a crunch effect, you know what I mean? Let's give it a try. Oh. Oh my goodness. Just the healthiest meal you could prob probably ever make. Mmm. almost too good hello friends and uh i've got an issue that i gotta take care of during the winter months while it's been uh getting down to i don't know 22 degrees at night obviously i have to keep my lithium batteries up to temperature above 32 degrees so i have that heater going on in the battery compartment that little computer fan heater it takes about 100 watts and I can't run that all night and run my diesel heater and my big freezer. So I've been using this to run my freezer and then my batteries to run everything else. I probably could run them all off of uh, the lithium batteries in the battery compartment, but I don't like to because I had the batteries die once because I had a cloudy day. It's just a lot safer to use this. Problem is, this will only run my freezer for about two days and then I have to use my generator to charge this back up and it's just really getting annoying doing that. Gotta run the generator quite a while in order to charge this up every two days. What I wanna do is I wanna run a line in here from the floor, I want to drill a hole right through the floor. And uh, let me show you. Now, I realize a lot of this looks like quite a mess, but everything has its purpose. There is some things I need to clean up. I want to use these two panels here to charge it up during the day um, without using the generator. So I'm going to drill some holes, push this up, um, into my place there, plug it into the power station, and then seal the hole around around the wires. Um, I'm thinking this ought to work, although the line's not very long on these, so I'm going to have to situate them afterwards. Wish me luck. Keeping my fingers crossed. All right, folks, so I got the hole drilled. I got everything all plugged up, which is real nice. This is what I use to plug up the hole. It's called Pest Block for uh, all sorts of pests. Hopefully that will uh, focus. For pests and bugs. Won't harm bees, by the way, it says. Anyways, I got that at Home Depot a while back, and I used it a while back, and I sealed it up, and I took the seal off. It still works because I don't trust the <laughs> I don't trust the seals that they have on these these funnels here. So I always seal them up myself so I can reuse them again. Anyways, you can see I'm getting 144 watts right now. Part of the solar panels are in the shade. But this will be automatic now, which is wonderful. I started out at 51%. It says it'll take 15 hours to charge up. Yeah, it's not much for solar, but 
It's certainly better than nothing. I think that'll be great. And the hole is all sealed up down there. Well, I'm pretty happy about that. And now that it's warmed up a little bit, um, my objective is to get out there and start cleaning up some of the mess that happened um, during the snowfall and the winter and all that. It's still the beginning of February, so it's probably going to snow a couple more times. But I want to get that yard cleaned up. A few people have commented on it, <laughs> and they were right. You know, I, I don't want it to be a mess. I'm not a messy person. It just so happens that I had so many projects going on this winter that a few things got left out. It is what it is. But I'm going to go out there right now, start cleaning up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for being patient. I haven't uploaded a ton of videos lately, but um, definitely uh, working on it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Woo!